Hey, what's going on guys? GTSS I'm back with another video here. We got the Sonny Deville Liv Morgan ready to be unboxed. I had a little uh, stack going over there and I just unboxed the Network Spotlight Oscar Diesel, Jinder, and Ray. Um, and I'm like, these two are sitting there. Might as well review them too. So I got those two and then I got a... Only thing left is a uh, Iconics 2 pack that I just got. So I got to do that too. But yeah, these are the exclusive. I found them at Toys R Us and they're on sale. Um, 20 bucks. I mean, I'm usually at least usually like 30 bucks. So 20 bucks for, I'm pretty sure we're, uh, us exclusives to target Walmart. I'm not sure, but I found my Toys R Us and I was like, Oh my God. And there's a lot of them, like a lot. So I might go back and get more because, uh, yeah, they go for quite, uh, quite a bit online. So I was like, hmm, maybe I'll grab a couple more. Um, yeah, so let's get these unboxed. I'll put this down here. I still need a tripod, of course. <laughs> Let's see what we got here yeah i was really i went in and i was in toys r us to get the network spotlights maybe five days before and i found those and there's only one set and i was like oh my god i gotta get those and then i went back like five days later and i found these and there was like eight of each probably and i'm like what i was like i saw them from a distance i'm like what is that and i was like, I was like oh my god that's the uh new sonya and freaking live i'm like holy shnikes i gotta grab those so, got that one out. Let's get the live out here too. So I wonder when Liv's coming back. She's been tweeting all that stuff. Hopefully it's soon. She's awesome. Oops. Spray paint. Oh, wow, that's like crazy detail. Holy moly. I totally forget what the... Uh, plant is called. I'm blanking. I don't know why. I should remember this, but I really can't. Oh, it exploded. The thing fell off. I should put that back together. Sorry, guys. It's taking so long. I'm just trying to build this little thing here. Ooh, the plant exploded. What is this plant's name? I remember it was on... Oh, I don't remember now. I'm totally blanking. I'll have to look it up later. So I got a little... Okay, the table and the plant are both breakaway which is kind of cool you do like some slam somebody through it a little spray paint can my trusty unboxing knife okay this little morgan is crazy detail holy moly okay wow that's really cool actually and those are cool sorry guys so here is the, the little table so liv came with the plant that breaks in three spots you can see the uh Crack there it breaks into three parts and the table breaks and it came a little spray paint can't do um so i'll do it here first i guess look at the colors and detail that's actually freaking awesome i really like this leg it's got all like the cheetah stuff that's super cool got the riot squad on the back this is of course when she was in the riot squad and i don't know if these things come up but i think you can undo it and it can move to pull them up that's super cool face scan is unreal Looks like perfect. Oh, this is a really nice figure. Holy moly. I really like the detail. That's awesome. And I like the accessory. That's really cool. I'm still blanking on what it's called, but here's the Sonny Deville. Actually, I do have Mandy Rose, the basic, I believe. The new one. So I can put them together, set them up. That's cool. Little tag team. Um, yeah, she looks with the jacket. It actually looks pretty cool. I'll take it off and see what it looks like. Well, this is pretty cool. It's nice cloth, too. A lot of figures don't come with the cloth that much anymore. Oh, she looks freaking sweet. That's cool attire. Got the black and yellow. That is, oh my God, that's actually really nice. What? I didn't realize it was that. I've never seen it with the robe off. And the face skin is killer. What? Okay, this is actually a really nice figure. She's got the black and yellow, the SD on the front there. Black and yellow on the back. Got the tattoos. Did they even write it? Like the letter, like the words on there? I don't know if it'll focus onto that for you guys to see. I'm just gonna look at it myself here. Oh wow, they really spelled everything that's on her back, the whole tattoo. That's unreal. I don't know if I can get that on focus. It's really close. Don't think so, eh? That's okay, but oh, there you go. That was too close. No, they actually wrote every word that's on there. That's pretty crazy. We got the tattoo on the side too. The little armband 
crazy good head scan. Does this come off or no? No, that's really, it's on there. Okay, well that's cool, I like that. No, that's a really good figure too, holy moly. Wow, I'm really happy with these two. These are sweet. I don't have that many uh, women um, on the roster. It's just I'd find, for some reason, um, the elites. We just, I just can't find them ever. They just never are around. When I go, it's just usually like just have males for some reason. I have recently, they have just been more. Like I picked up the Asuka. I found Shayna Baszler. I have Ronda. Um, I found Mandy Rose. And then I found these two. So I'm starting to find more. But before, I, and the Ruby Riot NXT TakeOver. Um, I'm starting to find them. But before, I just could not find them for the, at all. But uh, yeah, I'm glad I found these. These ones are sweet exclusives. So I'm really glad. I'm probably going to go back and get a couple more because you can't turn that 20 bucks. I'm pretty sure the sale's, the sale's still going, sorry. Um, so I'm definitely going to have to go grab some more of those. But uh, yeah, so that's those two. I just got the, I was going to throw the Iconics in this unboxing too. But uh, I'll just leave it for the exclusives. And I'll just do a quick video of uh, them later. But yeah, so hopefully uh, we get some new figures in because Toys R Us has been doing actually not so bad. They've been getting like the network spotlight <clears throat> exclusives. I found these. I found the Dynasty Takeovers like um, three weeks a month ago. And I found the, uh, the Iconics. So they're doing good. But, but Walmart lately have been sucking major ass. Like there's nothing. There's literally nothing. Like I went to not just, I go to the same one just to check. Because it's the closest one. But I went to like three others uh, in the area. And there's absolutely nothing. Like they have not like got anything. Like two, three months ago in the summer they had, uh, they kept getting like Elite 67 when it was pretty new. So that was awesome. So I got the whole line. I even got like the Chase Hardy and everything. But besides that, since then, they haven't got like anything new. They still have like WrestleMania freaking, uh, the WrestleMania series from last year still there they did the brutus and all that and they have like really old basics like series like uh like in the 80s and they just hit 100 so like they're really behind and the only elites they have are like the top talent not the new ones that came out but like somewhat recent the ones before that and like i have them all or a variation of that guy so it's like so hopefully they get some more stuff um the EBs in Canada are starting to get a little bit of stuff too, like three figures. So <laughs> we're getting somewhere, but my best bet right now is Amazon for sure because they got uh, they got the best deals and actually have pretty new figures that I would never find out here. So yeah, so I'm pretty pumped about that. And uh, yeah, I gotta do that uh, iconic review. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.